All right, Jennifer, we're going to go into program setup and just switch to Jake. <coughs> Pardon me. All right, done with setup. Hello, Jake. All right, so let's go to our orange and red flashing diamond, the police station in the river. Oh, Jake, no, you're even slower than Jennifer and, and really not cool. Police Chief Barron said we could see the police files on the four criminals. Let's see what we can dig up. Hello, Police Chief Barnes. Thanks for your help, Jake and Rosalka. I'm sure it was one of the four escaped criminals who robbed the bank. We have all four downstairs in the city jail. Once we identify the criminal, he'll tell us where he hid the money. He knows that the judge will give him a shortest jail sentence if he gives back the stolen cash. We interviewed Mr. Green and Mr. Washington at the scene of crime, but they weren't able to identify the robber. Any information you can dig up will help. Hey, thanks. Let's have a look at this one. The police file on Shorty Briggs is pretty thick. A summary sheet is on top. William Shorty Briggs, age 34, height 5'1", weight 175, dark hair, brown eyes, and sex head. No. <laughs> Police records in three states include armed robbery and jaywalking. Hmm. Lefty's Lefty Poltroon's police file contains his photograph and description. Joseph Lefty Poltroon, age 31, height 6'1", weight 230. Uh, blonde hair, blue eyes. Former weight heavyweight boxer, famous for his left hook, left-handed. Gee, I didn't get that from his nickname of Lefty. Froggy Forsyth. Police file is packed with the rest records. His description and mugshot are on top. Cecil Froggy Forsyth. Age 32. Height 6'2". Weight 190. Black hair, brown eyes. And I wouldn't call him very frog looking. Looks more like an elf. Anyway. Former professor of English literature has a fright has a slight limp and perfect manners. Oh, would you kindly please open your safe so I could take all your money? I can just imagine that happening. The police file on Red McShane contains arrest records from seven different states. His photo and description are included. Oh just beautiful. He just looks like he's looking for a gold rush to to yell at some kids at. Anyway, James Red McShane, age 33, height 6'2", weight 155, red hair, brown eyes. Part-time bronco rider and castle cattle rustler, large scar on right cheek. Alright, that's all we've got here. Let's go to the bank, which seems the most reasonable choice to me. Oh, hello, the camera looks like it's been broken. Probably has. Oh, Jake, you're just not cool. I'm sorry, man. The bank is almost empty. We were lucky it was Sergeant Nails at the door, because he knows us well and let us in. He said we can't stay long, though, so let's hurry before the real police get here. All right, let's speak to Mr. Green. The hold-up took place just after 1 p.m., when most of my tellers were out at lunch after the noontime rush. I was just reviewing the bad checks when I heard the shot. Which reminds me, Jake, your mother, she bounced a check. Can you please tell her she's going to jail or something? <laughs> the next thing I knew, a man in a mask was telling me to fill his bag with money. I could see his eyes through the mask, though. They were a dark brown. I could only see him from the waist up, because I was behind the teller window, but he must have been fairly tall. His eyes were level with mine. But I'm not going to tell you how tall I am. The teller windows, where customers do business, are on one side of the bank lobby and along counter lines the, the opposite wall. Pens are chained to the counter next to the stacks of deposit slips. The wall above the counter is covered by a large mirror. The wall to the left of the teller windows has a bullet hole in it. Okay. 
I couldn't go up to the actual teller windows and, and say that. I had to say it in the mirror. Okay. Let's have a look at the camera. A video camera is mounted on the ceiling of the bank so it can record any attempted robberies. Or successful robberies, apparently. Or maybe not. The camera has been destroyed by a bullet. Okay, cool. I think that's all we have time for this video, so we'll cut it here and we'll pick up again in a case. Okay, result out.